leading like a double life on alcohol and drugs. It's not that I was some secret agent or something, but the uh, life I was living was more of a death. I wasn't devoted to helping others and being clean and sober and just being a regular guy. Somehow I thought I was going to be some genius. Meth was going to make me brilliant. I'd stay up all night studying pass all these tests. In fact, what I actually did was stay up all night, not go to school, not study, and drop out and pass out. Booze was going to make me super popular and friendly because everybody knows that's what booze does, right? Uh, no. Weed was going to make me very introspective. I was going to learn deep things about life, such as I need more weed in order to function and I don't have any weed and I feel horrible because I need weed because weed is good for you. You know, all those kind of lies. Acid was going to give me the key to the universe. I don't know what universe it gave me the key to, but the key it gave me to the universe was a lousy, evil place. So obviously it was not a match made in heaven between drugs and myself, booze and myself. What about those people who can handle it? Who's talking about them? I didn't say nothing about them. Not everybody can handle everything they think they can handle. And some stuff's really bad for you whether you think you can handle it or not. But that's not my issue here. My issue is if you're like me, if you're a clean and sober person or your person wants to get clean and sober, why not do it? If you're, you know, surely you've used enough drugs and alcohol to learn whatever you were supposed to learn from them. What I le should have learned was don't use them because I can't handle them and they're not good for me. Not that I think they're so great for everybody else, but that's none of my beeswax. Clean and sober, though. Clean and sober. Let's stay clean and sober today together. It takes a lot of us to help each one of us. That's okay. What do they want us to do? You know, we just figure it all out on our own? No, physicists need physicists. Architects need architects. So we need... We can do it together, but I don't think I can do it on my own. But the great thing is I don't have to try.